Astra is the most hyped theme of 2025 and it's all over the internet. But is it actually as good? Or is it just another overhyped theme with a nice landing page? In this video, I'm going to break it down and show you what Astra does well, what it doesn't, and whether it's actually worth using in 2025, especially if you're building an online store with WooCommerce or just a clean professional site that loads fast. Astra comes with over 300 pre-built templates, works with Elementor and Gutenberg, and has a free version that's surprisingly powerful. And if you're looking to upgrade to Astra Pro, you unlock things like custom layouts, mega menus, advanced WooCommerce features, and more. So if you're deciding whether Astra is the right theme for your site, stick around. I'll show you what it's like to actually use it. Getting started with Astra is as straightforward as it gets. You install the theme, activate the starter templates plugin, and choose your builder, Elementor, Gutenberg, or Bevo Builder. From there, it's a one-click import and within minutes, you've got a full website, not just a homepage. Now let's look at a few things that Astra does really well. Number one, speed. Astra is built for performance. The core theme is under 50 KB and there's no bulky code to slow things down. I ran tests on a default Astra site using PageSpeed Insights and GT Metric, both scored in the high 90s out of the box. That said, once you start adding in actual products and changing things around, Astra is bound to slow down a bit. And there's a simple fix to that. Just go to the description below and click on this link. This will take you to Airlift's website where you can add your URL and Airlift will instantly analyze your page and give you a free optimization score. Number two, clean design. Astra doesn't force a particular design style. Instead, it gives you a layout structure that you can customize fully in the WordPress customizer. Number three, massive template library. With over 300 pre-built templates, you can launch in literally any niche. Everything from agency sites to personal portfolios to WooCommerce stores. And yes, the templates look professional and not basic boring sites. Number four, great WooCommerce integration. Even the free version of Astra gives you basic WooCommerce controls like product grid layout, dynamic toggles, and checkout page tweaks. But when you upgrade to Astra Pro, you get sticky add to cart, product quick view, distraction free checkout, and layout customization that honestly rivals many dedicated WooCommerce themes. Number five, page builder friendly. Whether you're using Elementor, Spectra, or just sticking with Gutenberg, Astra doesn't have conflict issues. Honestly, it's one of the best builder-safe themes you can pick. That said, I did have some layout problems using some templates on Elementor as the containers just shifted around. But Astra isn't perfect. Here's what I want them to improve on. Number one, the header builder is still... Mm, yes, you can drag and drop, but compared to themes like Cadence or Block C, Astra's visual builder feels slightly clunky and dated. And finally, to get the most out of Astra, you often need additional plugins, card flows, spectra, etc. It's manageable, but not as out of the box as the marketing makes it seem. Number three, no native dark mode. If you're building a site in 2025, dark mode toggle is just expected. Astra doesn't have it, not even in pro, and that's a bummer. So should you use Astra in 2025? Yes. If you want speed and a bunch of free templates that are really well designed, Astra is still one of the best themes out there. I've also left an exclusive 25% discount code in the pinned comment below. Feel free to grab it if you're planning to upgrade. Let me know what theme you are using right now or comment below if you want a full Astra tutorial.